yeah. Y'all know what day it is. Finally, Friday. Today is Snap on Friday. There's the man. So let's see what he's got. You guys, come on. Man, you know what that means when you're here? We almost through. Almost through. Thank goodness. Man, almost. you got the newest, is that the newest, latest, greatest snap-on wire welder? <laughs> That'd be it right there now. Man. That joker probably welded a bunch of stuff in his day, though. You got some miles on it, I'm sure. Mm-hmm. Still going strong, too. All right. That's a 110? It is. Holy cow, that's a big joker for a 110, ain't it? That's the, uh, it's still got the same model number. It ain't even got a superseded model number as the new ones do. Really? Mm-hmm. They're uh, pretty much just like it, but solid. Now, find the page. Would somebody trade it in on a new one? I, well, trade it in on some other stuff. They had two of them. They was using both of them. And uh, I actually brought it up to him about trading it in on some stuff. Trying to hope maybe on down the road they realize they do need two of them and you have to buy a new one, you know? Yeah. Hey, how much you want for that rig? Do, uh, it's got to be cheap. Yeah, about do 1100 on it. Yeah. I ain't bad. No. Here's what the uh, newer model ones look like. Can't buy a new one for that. Be right here. They almost look identical. Yeah. <laughs> Wonder what Close year that two. Joker was made. Probably I don't know. Early nineties or something. Probably so. That's what it. You know, that's the style it looks like anyway. Yeah. The lead we actually put. He ordered that lead and put it on there about a year and a half ago, and it's the same exact part numbers for the new one still. That's something, ain't it? That's a good. I mean, I bet you'd be a, a good welder. Yeah. I about keeping it for myself, but y'all bought didn't snap on buy one of the big welding companies out. Now you got uh, Systematics who does all our uh, stuff with the welders and everything. Um, I'm not sure if they're in on Systematics on ownership. Part. No, I I'm, I, it may be the AC machines that I'm thinking we, about. Yeah, they now we do our own AC machines. Everything is in Arkansas now. Yeah. Uh, can't think of the town, but all of our AC machines like we used to be with Robin there. They would make the machines for some of those good machines, uh, but they wanted to uh, decrease quality on some of the internal parts by going overseas instead of being American made. Right. Uh, of course, I mean, cost efficiency, I imagine what the reason was, but Snap on wasn't in on it and they just did it. I said, own no that. bueno, huh? Yeah. ain't doing that. And, uh, <laughs> yeah. So the first, what, year and a half I was in business, I sold the Robin Air version. Yeah. Then we, we uh, didn't have one for about two or three months where all that dispute and so snap also done on their own and the new ones have been uh good we saw a bunch of them well i know i can't fuss about the service i received off mine yeah but we sent somebody out here two or three times couldn't fix it so we just find a leak in it and hamilton said piss on this here's a brand new one yeah i'm getting tired of messing with it cause and then left that old one here for like probably six months and me and you was playing with it one day and we found it. where it was leaking yep. and fixed that joker <laughs> <laughs> yeah i remember that i i Tired of messing with it. <coughs> yep. I know you would, especially after, I mean, you lose. You, you know, uh, when I first got it, I filled the bottle all the way up. Yep. Like as much as it would hold. On Friday. And I left like four pounds in it. Well, Tuesday, we went to use it the next week. Well, some butt was out of free on it. I'm like, <laughs> man, quit playing, dude. And I, sure enough, it was. It, it was out. every bit of it out. Yeah. Like when I walked in the shop that morning, I was like, man, it's not like free on leak. In here, there was all right, and we even <laughs> shut the valves off and everything on it because we <laughs> snap on was like, Well, they sent somebody out, didn't want to fill it up, so he filled it up or put some in it, yeah. And now he still, used my free on, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember like, that because he got I'm like, Yeah, yeah, he didn't even bring none, yeah. I remember that because he wanted like, to borrow my sniffer, remember, yep. <laughs> 
Yeah, that, that boy was like that, the heck of this. He came out of Memphis. I remember that. Yeah. Yeah, because we, I remember I had to get the money back to reimburse you on the free run. <laughs> Did you get the hog ring in? Crap, no. What are we going to do? Find another snap on guy. The one we got sucks. <laughs> <laughs> No, I think that they're oh, actually supposed man. to be here Saturday, I think, what it said on through uh, the UPS email. Well, I got a funny story to tell you about Monday. Uh-oh. I had a terrible day Monday. Well, most Mondays is Well, this was already. an unusually bad Monday, like horror Monday. Like when I think about it, I hear that horror music playing, <laughs> you know. So I had a lot of tools in the trouble Monday. So I got aggravated with a half inch gun, my stubby. And then I broke down, was finally gonna get my drill and use it as a bit driver since my snap-on bit driver was at home. And my hammer drill trigger wasn't working. So I took all that junk and I had it sitting in a box. Well, when Joe come in Monday, he always does the same thing every week. Pulls up and runs straight into the bathroom. <laughs> Old man gotta go to the bathroom now. And uh, he come out and said, what are you doing with all that Milwaukee? I said, I'm finna get rid of that damn junk what I'm fixing to do. <laughs> he said, why? I said, every bit of it needs to be sent back. He said, you're kidding. We started putting batteries in it, and he was just flabbergasted. He couldn't believe it. Could couldn't he? believe that I, all that Milwaukee stuff. He's like, this is brand new. It don't even have hardly a scratch on it. I'm like, yeah, no kidding. <laughs> brand new. So, anyway, he's sending it all back. So, we're going to have to... Joe was heartbroken. We're going to have one. to make a change. Yeah, he was trying to get a trade up to the Blue Link or whatever they call it, one key or that, whatever. Yeah, Milwaukee Blue one key stuff. stuff. All right, Joe, I'm done. Like, <laughs> done. But you done. That's what we're going to do. So I'm in the market for something different. We got you half inch on the way. And uh, I think, uh, what did they say on that? Well, they gotta have a better drill than the 14 four. Yeah, it's the 14 four is the one, but the 18 volt is pretty stout. That little 14 four. Man, you couldn't drill a kidney stone out of the end of it if it was stuck. <laughs> that, thing, that thing was bad weak. <laughs> yeah, the little 14 four one. So the half, what is it, a half inch? You got the 18 volt is a half inch truck. Yeah. And you can get the, uh, we got two versions. The was 8815 I think is without the hammer drill and then you get the 8850H with the hammer drill. Is it, and, uh, can you cut it on and off? The hammer drill? Yeah. Yep. You just twist it like, like any other ones. Just yeah. twist it to the hammer or to the drill or I think the third click is the uh, where you can adjust it on your clutch by how much pressure you want it to put on it. Well do they have like a a combo kit? Is it like two batteries and a charger? And the, and the tool and on the, the tool. kits. And then you could buy a tool only. Yep, just so like any of the rest of them. Yeah, you can buy the, the tool with the tool with the battery or the kit. What was it around about 34000 <laughs> Plus tax. <laughs> <laughs> Man, everybody thinks that's funny that you say that, but I know you, all of you guys get sick of hearing, God, how much is that? God, that's expensive. Y'all got to get tired of hearing that. <laughs> so have you heard any word on the new brushless 861s yet? The 144 ones? Yeah. I haven't. I know that they came out with the uh, the new, I can't think of the number on that, but the 8810s, they got the new version of these, it's lithium. I mean, that's uh, brushless. brushless. Um, I haven't seen one. The only one I know of, I think Herschel got one, and I think Brandon Hickman got one. Oh, the brushless 3.8s? Yeah. Um, like I the seen... 14 fours? No, no, oh, no the, the 18 volts. Well, I know no. a guy. I, I've seen told pictures me of the 14 four. That it definitely had a rocker trigger, without a doubt. Like, yeah. He's put it in his hands to play with it. He said it definitely has a rocker trigger. So I'm happy. Like, I know there was. Make my day. There was a dealer that got in trouble. Or I'm not sure if the dealer did, but. Some places, like there's a guy out of Texas that he does very good for himself. Um, he actually runs a truck for another guy who owns four or five trucks, but he's one of the top producers, and he gets to try out 
or he got shops that tries out all the new tools. Yeah. And uh, somebody took a picture of the 18 volt 3 8 brushless and posted it on their Instagram or oh, Facebook oh, or somewhere. Yeah. And uh, I think they got the phone call and they had to go get that thing pretty fast from him. And that shop was cut off the list from trying out new tools just because of that picture. Yeah. Got it me. happens, you know. Yeah. Well, I guess figure me up a, a price on it. So these will be put on sale in pretty soon then, won't they? Oh, yeah. Since they're going out. Old style. They'll probably still keep them hanging around like they do the 8850s. Because some people want the brushed ones, I guess. I don't know. Man, I just hate to have to deal with another battery. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> so what up? You want half inch drill? And three eighths, or not? The, you got the fourteen four. Yeah, I got so. the fourteen four. Is them stronger than the four? This one's rated for like two twenty. What it's rated for? Just like anything else, it's gonna give you the two twenty all day long. So it'll definitely do two twenty. It's gonna do the two twenty. Uh, the brushless, I think somebody said it was two fifty or three hundred. I haven't seen the spec sheet on it. Uh, I might could look it up real quick and see. But these most definitely the 220. Or just the, check on the drill and the, the half inch. I just guess. two batteries, two yeah. tools, and two tools, two batteries. The charger is a dual charger, ain't it? Where the yeah, all the any one you buy with 18 volts will come with the dual chargers now. Oh, well, that's a good thing. I need to find me some of them. They still make them 7.2 batteries. Oh, the last ones I seen on them was like two years ago. I'd have to try to find, they're not in the book, uh, but the ones that we got two years ago was all brand new, so I'm sure that they, we could still get it. I'd have to check and see, though. I'd have to find one somewhere that have an old part number that I could find a super seed off I of. I got one in there. I would look at it and see then. But I need to try to find me a, I like that little bitty gun. Yeah. Boy, it's probably gonna hurt my feelings here in this number. <laughs> next to the toolbox. That's probably gonna be a big number to hear. Oh, you know it's bad. He's breaking out the calculator. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be bad. Man, I can't believe they're taking that long to send a hog ring. Well, that, them don't come through snap on. That goes through somebody else. Oh. That goes through uh, quick clips. Or just clips, I mean. <laughs> I checked it both ways, and that full price, the drive body on the drill will be 334 The kit on the half inch will be 942 Of course, like I said, we're going to be that's full list. We'll never operate a full list. And the, and the kit on the drill was 767 and the drive body on the half inch is 509 Both of them come out to be 1276 so I was trying to look at different ways to yeah. get it cheaper. So we're going to get you. smokes. Yeah. 1300 bucks. That's more than that for tax when you add tax on it. Yeah, the snap on tax about 33 34%, I think. Oh, shit. No. <laughs> but nah, we'll be able to get it a lot less than that, though. Yeah. Mm. Actually, I got a, a drill that I sent off uh, the other day for repair. This one come back, I mean, as a brand new one. Mm -hmm. It'd be probably a chuck or something, be a used one. That is be for sale. They'd be a lot cheaper because I bought it for super cheap from a fella. There you go. That's what I need. Mean. You need to buy impact from that same guy. <laughs> Trade him out. <my> <laughs> I ain't sure where the drill where the <laughs> drill came from. I don't know. It didn't come off any of my guys because I searched the serial number on it. Yeah. All right. Well, let me know. We'll yeah. Check her out. It sent off as orange, but I told him on the red one when it came back. So we'll. That'll work. All right, guys. Well, I guess we're going to turn this thing off and get back after it because we got a little bit more time and finally, Be finally, off work. we can get out of this hell hole. All right, guys. Y'all have a great week. Thank y'all for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to hit that thumbs up. Check over here for merchandise, cool tools, discount codes, all that good stuff's in the description. If you're not subscribed, like, I don't know what you're waiting on. You take your finger, you press that button. It's free. Just it's click easy. It. You just click it. It don't even, it's like walking on the snap-on truck. It don't cost you nothing. It's just very tempting. <laughs> All right, guys. Catch you next time. See ya.